Hello there. Uh, this is a response tag video uh, to a good friend of mine, Graham, on his channel WXPM. And this tag video is about what uh, navigational equipment one thing I would take with me if I could only choose one thing. Now, believe it or not, I'm in a bit of a pickle with this tag video at this minute because. Uh, my wife's stepfather is going off walking tomorrow and I've borrowed him my uh, compass and GPS unit. Now really I don't agree with borrowing any of my equipment to anyone unless I know them really well. Because uh, you know your equipment you've got to look after it and respect it really and that's what I do. But I can tell you what I would choose. Now I have three, um, three things. Uh, a sat map is one, and that's a GPS unit, which has a, it's, it's a bit more advanced um, electronic GPS unit. You can put um, 125 scale, 150 scale maps of, say, the Snowdonia National Park or every national park in the UK. And indeed, uh, in Europe as um, abroad, um, I don't tend to use that that often. But um, if I do use that one, it's mainly uh, to find. It gives you the list of the mountains you're on, and it gives you um, where every water source is. Really, it's uh, it's a bit like Google Earth, if you like, but <laughs> in a little unit. And that's a sat map um, active 10 plus uh, the second gps unit i've got but i've as i say i've borrowed it to my uh, stepfather-in-law and that is a, a garmin 60. Uh, i use that a lot if i geocache uh, as well that one is a good uh, gps unit but if i had to pick one it would be uh, a compass uh, with my map and <clears throat> I've got maps of several um, like the Lake District, Snowdonia and indeed Cluid itself and it's a silver compass which is a good make as Graham, Graham's got a silver as well um, I've had this about, well, about two years uh, I did have a cheaper compass before that while I was learning different things and I'm still learning now um, and it's an Expedition 4 compass and uh, it's a great compass it's, um, it, it's a, a scratch free acrylic compass has got Roma scales um, and it's got measuring markers in uh, inches and in millimetres and the Roma scale is uh, one comes in 140, uh, 150, and 125 um, scale uh, measuring scale, and it also has a, a dry flex grip, which is um, fantastic in wet weather, really. And um, I've got a basic knowledge on uh, map and compass work, which I always have it with me, and I know how to how to use it. But on that subject, uh, I'd like to really thank Graham as well. Uh, he's a good friend of mine. We've done a few videos together. And uh, always great fun doing it. And uh, the outtakes are always longer than the film itself, really. <laughs> but I'd like to thank him, really, because uh, he's got on his channel on WXPM uh, land navigation tutorials, videos, and they cover you know basics into advanced um, navigation and I followed them and you know I keep looking back at them and I've learned a lot that way because I personally learn more through watching and learning and uh, that certainly done me good so uh, thanks for that Graham so that would be my choice it's uh, an expedition for silver compass 
uh, fantastic uh, bit of kit. I would show it you, but as I say, it's uh, <laughs> it's been borrowed to my stepfather-in-law, which I will uh, get back tomorrow evening, without doubt. Um, it's a tag video, so I'm going to tag another three people. And the first one is Sean Mulhall, uh, Sean the Silver Fox. Everything, he does everything in bushcraft and stuff like that. Um, if he watches these videos, uh, I watch his, I don't know if he watches mine, but he's the first choice. And I'll put these at the end of the video, the channel names. Uh, the second choice is uh, Mike in Wall to Rock Climber. And he's another bushcrafter, wild camper, um, walker. He'll know his stuff about navigation. Um, and as I say, I'll put the link at the end of the video. In the video, and the second, the third one will be Sepp Valtenvec, and he's always out in the mountains. Um, you know, wild camping, bushcraft, um, lighting fires by bow drill and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, they're my three choices, and. So um so that's it really. So uh, thanks for watching. And thanks to Graham WXPM and uh, I'll speak to you soon.